People who struggle with anxiety and anxiety disorders can have a hard time maintaining relationships because of their anxiety. But that doesn't mean that dating someone with anxiety has to be hard or that the relationship can't work. Keep watching for some important tips for dating someone with anxiety. Learn about anxiety. One of the best things you can do as a partner of somebody with anxiety is to learn about their anxiety. This means both learning about anxiety as a mental illness and learning specifically about your partner's anxiety. Take the time to do some research about anxiety. Focus specifically on the different ways anxiety can show up in people's lives. The tricky thing about anxiety is that it looks different for each person. So, learning all the ways anxiety can manifest will help you pinpoint when your partner is struggling. On top of doing your own research, ask your partner to talk about their experience of their anxiety. Learn from them how their anxiety shows up in their life. Canceled plans. People with anxiety often struggle with keeping appointments they've made, which includes that date they made with you last week. There are many reasons for this, which depend on how their anxiety is currently showing up in their life. They may cancel plans because they're exhausted from dealing with their constant anxious thoughts. Or they might cancel because the actual date is making them anxious. They're wondering if you'll be happy to see them, if they're dressed okay, if you really like them at all, if they picked the right restaurant, and on and on. Or they might cancel because they accidentally overbooked because they forgot to write down the date. But one reason they probably didn't cancel is that they don't like you anymore or don't want to see you. Chances are they really do want to see you, but their anxiety is so overwhelming they just can't get past it. So don't take it personally. Give them a pass and make another date. Don't try fixing. Feelings are really tough for people with anxiety. They tend to get overwhelmed pretty easily and feel things really intensely. And when they have big feelings and get overwhelmed, their anxiety takes over. This makes it hard for them to be rational. In American society, we're not taught how to handle big feelings. Most people get uncomfortable when they see other people having a hard time. Their first instinct is to try to find a way to fix the big feelings so that they won't be uncomfortable and so the person having the big feelings won't be so upset. While the intent is good, there's no way to fix feelings and there's definitely no way to fix anxiety. If you try to fix your partner's anxiety or feelings, they're likely to feel like you're being dismissive or not understanding. The best thing you can do is let them talk about their feelings and offer reassurance. If you feel comfortable doing so, you could try to talk them through some grounding exercises like deep breathing or naming things they say in the room, which can help them get a handle on their anxiety. But know that you're not capable of fixing their feelings. All you can do is to support them while they're having feelings. Dating someone with anxiety requires work, but so does any healthy, functioning relationship. People with anxiety can be amazing partners, especially when they're supported by amazing partners. If you keep these things in mind, your relationship will thrive. For more information about how to be a supportive partner to someone with anxiety, check out our blog. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe.